Good morning vlog! Happy Tuesday. Um, it's like 8.30. Eating breakfast. Look at this. Look at that. My new favorite thing is like strawberries on almond butter toast with dates and cinnamon. So good. Um, but it's my last week of school. It's finals week. But like, I feel like last week was worse because I had to do all the work and now it's just like crit crits critiques all day um for like all my classes but it's a very exciting week my birthday's on saturday it's gonna be a good week um yeah so basically today i have my first year seminar class and i'm hoping it's gonna be really short and after that i'm jetting down to lucadia going to bing to pick up my new longboard i'm so excited um i think i'm gonna do a little thrifting maybe on the way down and yeah, that's what's going on today. But I'm just gonna eat this, go to class, and see you in a bit. Okay. So like, uh, okay, bye. Hey guys, I'm pulling a risky move, vlogging in the school parking lot. But that was my last official class for this class. Monday, I have another class on Monday because we had like a bomb threat. Um. Like midway through the year, so we missed a Monday, so they're like trying to make it up. It's like a snow day, except this is the California version of a snow day, apparently. But yeah, this is my last of this class, which I'm pretty happy about. Not not the biggest fan of this class. Um, it's like 9 50. I'm gonna head down to San Diego and pick up the board. My parents, my dad, and my mom are helping me out by, by buying it, which is insane. So my dad's gonna call and I'm just gonna pick it up. I don't have my straps. Okay, yeah, we're good, so. I'm nervous, I get so scared going into um like surf shops and stuff. I feel like I probably talked about this before, but like the surf environment I grew up in was heavily angry, male dominated. So I feel like I automatically go into these situations that, oh, everyone's judging me. Oh, like I'm, I don't know. I get like weirdly insecure and aggro about it and I have to like hold my ground, especially because I grew up surfing like my dad's old board so all I know is how to surf a board that's too conventionally too big for me but like I I, I don't know so like I'm getting a 9.8 for someone my height and weight I should probably be surfing like a 9.2 um my last board was a 9.4 and I want something bigger because I have more lower body strength than um upper body strength so it will be easier to get into waves and I can turn something bigger because my legs are stronger if that makes sense like that's what I used to I'm also not really turning or anything I just want to set a line and walk so that's my justification but I'm scared like I'm gonna walk in and be like oh yeah I'm picking up this board for Ella and whoever's working there is gonna be like what the fuck is she doing like why is she taking this big of a board but then again, I don't really care, but nervous, but I think I'm gonna go thrifting first, so we'll see. Okay. Bye. Also, 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 I wanna, we had to do like evaluations at the beginning of the year and like mine pretty much stay the same. My mental health went down one, which is interesting, but I think that's more stress than like crisis. But we had to write letters and <laughs> This is my letter. It says, Dear Ella, today I actually feel pretty... This is on January 23rd. Okay. Dear Ella, today I actually feel pretty good. I feel stable, actually. Mentally sound. Home is good. The fact that I'm calling my new house home already is a good sign. I'm in a healthy, loving relationship with myself and my boyfriend. Life is just good. As far as classes go, I've only taken my pictorial design class and Adobe Illustrator is a bitch. There's a lot of new info really fast. Hopefully by the end of semester, I'll know it like the back of my hand. This semester, I hope to grow my confidence as an artist and stop negatively comparing myself to others' work. I also hope to fine-tune my skill set and hone in on a certain aspects and areas of my art. I want to have the knowledge to make the right connections in the art world. 
Goals wise, everywhere else, I want to go through 114 and sell out of everything. I want to do more hiking, running, and walking. I want to surf more. I want to generate a routine that balances work and play. I want to grow my social media, and I want to continue to feel as happy as I do now. And I want my mom's chemo to go well and for her to be completely cancer-free forever. Love, Ella. Anyway, so, like, the funny thing is, is, like, the Adobe Illustrator thing, I ended up using Procreate a lot more, but I have that dialed now. My teacher yesterday, a really tough teacher, was like, you're like you've mastered digitally blending which is huge coming from him so that really fluffed my ego but i would say i have um procreate down pretty well illustrator yeah i do for the most part not great i just don't use it as often but the digital drawing aspect of it i look at my procreate drawings and sketches from the beginning of the semester versus now i should put in pictures it's huge it's been huge for 314 314 is popping off I haven't been giving it as much love as I'd like just because it's been busy and I've been broke. But these little art markets I've been doing, fucking huge. There's people that are like, oh my god, like, I have this shirt, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, that's for my first drop ever. And now you're here. You're a real person. So that's cool. Um, routines, like, I'm spending so much time outside. I've been hiking almost every single day. I can't run because of my hip, but walking, hiking, and stuff. I have a job. I have friends. I, um, my relationship's going good. My self-esteem, I mean, I feel like I'm always gonna have, like, weird self-deprecation issues, but, like, all of these goals. My mom's doing good. Like, everything's good. Like, no complaints. Okay, I need to go. I also don't want anyone to see me because that would be hashtag embarrassing. The day everyone here finds out that I make stupid little videos, I'm never going to hear the end of it. I will never hear the end of it. That's okay. Okay, bye guys. Okay, we have made it. We have made it to the thrift shop. I'm in Cardiff. What now? Um, board has been purchased by father, so I just get to go pick it up. Actually, I think the guy I'm picking up from, this kid that works there, he used to live in Cayucas. Isn't that strange? He, like, knows, like, all the people I knew. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm so tired right now, I need a coffee. Hmm. We're scheming. Okay, um... Yeah, I'm gonna go through for a hot second. It's not a very big one. I don't think it'll take me very long, but we'll see. Okay. Board acquired. I don't know if you can see it. I'm so excited! Okay, and then I also got a smoothie at Nectar and Grove. It's literally right next to the big shop. Um, it's like a cold brew, banana. Fuck, I hate these things. Cold brew, banana, almond butter situation. So the only thing I've consumed today is almond butter, bananas, and coffee. Like, that was literally what my I had for breakfast. I had a, um, she double lit it. What the hell? Hold on, guys. Um, toast with almond butter and bananas, and I had a coffee. Now I'm having a coffee almond butter smoothie with banana. Hello? All right, whatever that works. Mm, that's good. Usually I need like a midday caffeine pick me up. So this is like lunch and the caffeine pick me up all in one. I think Europe's are giving me acne, but I don't want to admit that. Because I like, but I think they are. But I don't want to admit it, so I'm like in denial of it. But I think. Because they have like so much fucking sugar in them, you guys. But then the non sugar ones taste so bad. Oh my god, that looks like a squirrel that used to live by me. Whoa. Anyways, okay, we're gonna go back to Laguna. Back to the OC, guys. We're going back to Laguna. Okay, that's all. Bye. Okay, my house is officially a boardroom. Like, this is chaotic. But, so this board is 9 feet 8 inches. And the span of my wall to my front door is 11 feet. So, it, like... It fits, but like the door, if someone like slammed it open, it would like, hit the fin. 
But this is what we're working with. This is where I used to keep all my other ones. That's like my desk and all my art stuff right there. But yeah, there she is. And then the other boards I put in this corner. That's This one's eight foot. And this one's like seven, seven oh, I think. I think, it, yeah, seven oh. So yeah, that's like my other, I guess it's a log, I don't know. And then this is like, like a little like egg fun shape. It's a quad and a single setup. So I write it single though. Um, and then this corner, this lamp used to be in that corner, but I put it there and then I have like four string instrument situations. My skateboard. So like, it doesn't look bad, but like, I don't know. I want to get a different light. I want to get like an actual rug to put there. I think that would be really cool. Um, but yeah, that was hectic. Um, oh, but I got my blanks for volume nine. Whoa, I think it's volume nine for a 314. I want to show you what I got. Okay. Okay, this is Le Hall. Um, I have a wholesale account with the place that prints the shirts. Dude, there was like these girls at the last market I did and they're like, is this like an actual kid's shirt? Cause I sell baby tees and they're, they're women's baby tees. I, I promise you, they are women's baby tees. Like, is this a kid's shirt? And I was like, no, like I get them. It's a woman's baby tee. It's just a fitted look. It's a baby tee. And they're like, okay. And then she like whispered to her friend. She's like, she's not, it's definitely a kid's shirt. I was like, bruh, like, come on now. Guys, they're, they're adult, they're adult shirts. I swear. I size up in them personally, but that's up to you. Um, okay, I'm so excited. Well, I got this for me. I'm gonna try this out, and if these are cool, I might do a print on them. It's just like a mini dress, and it's like brown, like thick cotton, and it's ribbed. I don't know. I thought it was cute, just like easy. I'm going to France this summer, so maybe I'll bring that. Ooh, wait, I just thought of that. And then. This little brown baby tee. I had another print on it. I think I have one left. It's the Sacred Heart baby tee on my website. And that was from like my second, third collection ever, I think. Um, but yeah, just bringing back the brown. I like it a lot. You don't have to wear a bra with it. It's not see-through or anything. Very soft. And then I'm trying these out. They're like... Little tank tops. Look how cute that is. Oh my god. And I'm gonna do a print right there. So that is all. And uh, um stay tuned. Hopefully actually not hopefully. Before the end of this month there will be a new collection. I just have to finish up a few things and then we will be dialed in. So let me get through finals, you guys. Do you want to see a thrift haul, too? I guess I'll give you a thrift haul. I guess. Okay, so first I got this backpack. It's like a Quicksilver like travel backpack. And it's pretty big. And it's like deep. And it has a million pockets. And it's waterproof. And it's carry-on size. So I'm thinking I can travel with this this summer. I think it would be a very good travel bag. Yeah, it just has like a shit ton of pockets and compartments. And it's like the depth on it. It's in really good shape. We had a Quicksilver backpack with my family that we would travel with all the time, but it's like a little smaller than this. And I just, I really liked, I really liked this. It's like old quick too. Pretty cool. It's like the logo right there, but yeah, travel bag. Cause I have like an Osprey like backpacking one, but it doesn't hold as much, so I can really shove this one full, and then, okay, here's the haul. Okay, guys, this is so cute. This little, like, button front, like, dress. Look at this pattern. It's like little beach stuff, and it ties, which I am a slut for. 
<laughs> it ties in the back so you can like cinch your waist in. And then I got these um, Polo Ralph Lauren jeans. But I'm gonna cut them into a jorts because I need to open another pair of jorts. Yeah. But I thought they were really cool. I love their back tag. Labels, labels, labels. And then I got this Joy Lab sports bra because it's like brand new and I like the purple and it's good for hiking. And I like Joy Lab a lot actually. They're like a little Target brand. Um, but yeah, and then I got this for hiking too. It's like a green. I'm pretty sure this is Joy Lab too. I don't know, it's just like a chartre chartreuse, like long sleeve. I, I literally wear them every day. So that's that. Then I got this little cardigan. So Forever 21, but I don't know, it's cute. I live in cardigans. I liked how the sleeves weren't like notched in, you know what I mean? And then I got a bunch of blanks to press 3104 stuff on this like little tank top with thick strap i'm gonna crop these next two but this like tan ish like neutral one and then this brown uh, green olive green ribbed one and then this really cool like old banana republic one it's like a pretty lilac but i like to like um this little collar detail it's just like literally like a white seam but it looks cool and then I never check the CD section, but I decided as of today, I'm gonna start collecting CDs so for my car. So I got a Best of Aretha Franklin CD, which this is Frank Sinatra duets. So every song is one of his duets. So we got Aretha Franklin on there, Barbara Streisand, Tony Bennett, Natalie Cole. Okay guys, today is my last figure drawing class for the semester and I cannot be more excited. I mean, I liked, sorry, I'm trying to put my shoes on. I liked like learning about it and stuff. I just had a hard time with the professor and her teaching style and I am really not one for drawing realism. Oh my God. Drawing realism, let alone people. I mean, you guys see my drawings. It's always very illustrative and distortive. Granted, I am illustration emphasis major, so I mean, it makes sense. But yeah, we're done. I think today is just a crit, but I'm still gonna bring all my stuff. I don't even know how long I'm gonna be there for today. But, like, I guess I'll pack all my stuff. Lunch. But, yeah. Peace and love. Peace and love. So, my class got out so early. So, that means time to go to the beach. It's finally sunny out. It's a little windy. But, I think it'll be okay. Um... Yeah, I'm doing that. I just had an existential crisis because I hate the way my body looks in every single bathing suit I own, but it's fine. Um, going with this one, it's from Sayulita, Mexico, this little shop. But I just feel disgusting and unhappy with how I look, but we're going to go get tan, so... I was so scared.
there, I was like gonna get a, like a car accident on the way home, and this like I'm not even worried about my own life. Like something was gonna happen before. <laughs> I'm so scared to ride it though. Just for a leash. No, I know. I'm just like scared that like it's like gonna be like all my fears confirmed that like I just like can't surf it. You will be able to surf it. Like it just it like it doesn't matter it doesn't matter like nothing else matters now. You have it, you'll be able to surf it, well, and you'll like, have so much fun. Is, like, I'm going to regret it, like, oh, shit, I should have gotten, like, the easier, like, beginner boards. Mm -hmm. You're not a beginner, though. But, like, I'm not... <laughs> you guys, I just have a new board, and it's so fun. It's so good. Um, it's really fast, but it's, like, super, like, stable, if that makes sense. So, like, you stay, like, way out of the pocket. Like, you don't get caught up in anything, but you're not, like, super, like, squirrely. And I was really worried that I wouldn't be able to turn it because it's so big, but it's actually easier to turn, I think, because there's more stability. So you can kind of crank it like you would, like, it's, like, it feels more grindy, even though it's a single fit, if that makes sense. But, oh my god, it's so fun. It's kind of big too. Like, the sets are like pretty much all overhead. Like, on the old guys. So, like, they're tall, tall on me. Anywho, there's some little kids out here that are absolutely ripping, and I'm so jealous. Okay, that's all. I also look insane. Uh, in um, Toy Story, where he, where the dude, where the, where the guy who owns the store like gets in his car and drives across the street to go home. That's you. <laughs> That's you Fuck driving you. to a local surf spot in Cayucas. <laughs> He's literally laughing at yourself. For context, my home is literally like a two second walk to the water and then you can drive down two minutes to the pier. But you have to drive, so you put it in the back of the truck. Because I said I missed my truck. <laughs> You're from Toy Story. Can we watch Toy Story tonight? Yeah, not tonight. Okay. It's gonna be too. Isn't it gonna be too late? Hey, we can watch it while eating burritos. That's true. Wait, are we bringing the burritos back? Yeah, so I'm fucking cold and wet. I'm gonna eat my burrito at home. <laughs> <laughs> mm hmm. Sandy. Ah. No. Ah. Did you watch the latest video? What? Have you watched the latest vlog? Of course I have. So look at my zoom in of you spitting it on. Fucking straw on you. It's not focusing. Oh, now it is. Hey vlog, happy Thursday. Um, I'm, I worked from seven to two today. It's now four and I'm driving to Miles. We're gonna go surf. And I don't feel like a real human right now. I feel like I have not stopped moving once again. So there's that. Anyway, happy Tuesday. Cheers. What? Cheers. Chess.
This feels pretty sticky. No, I think it's gonna be good. It's definitely cool water though. Yeah. But it's okay. Mm -hmm. It might be kind of slick because of that. But... I think it'll be fine. It'll be fine. This board, you guys, hold up, focus. This board. This board is so fun. Look how insane I look. This is what I look like when I'm sitting out there being an idiot. Miles well, said one more way, so I took one in. But he took another. He paddled that out. It's okay. Also, I, I can't stop saying meow. Art school has turned me into a furry. Hell. Hey, both. Guess what day it is? It's my birthday. And that is like 5 30. I'm going to surfing. No, I didn't even give it that much thought when I heard this morning. Yen said it's a really hot summer's day down here, 24 degrees. I said, yeah. Julien a la Philippe. And my, my colleagues, uh, all from you know, Great Britain and, and Ireland. Birthday! Birthday! <laughs> Sorry, it's the Australian. <laughs> I mean, what do you have to say? What do you have to say? Hi, I'd like to thank my fans. I'd like to thank each and every one of you for getting me to where I am today. I'd like to thank my mother and my father for birthing me. I'd like to thank the Academy for presenting me with this award and giving me this opportunity today. I'd like to thank California for my naivety and lack of culture. <laughs> And high well, expectations. <laughs> I'd like to thank everyone in the Santa line for well, the lack of surf we will probably end up getting. If we don't get in, we can just go tonight. This is true. Or Doho on the way back. Yeah, I mean, dude, <laughs> no. Yeah, we could just go tonight if we don't get in. I don't think. I don't think we won't, but in case, you know. Because I feel like last time. This happened and everybody um, Everybody just went to the camp, campground, so I don't know. But, oh, like a contest again? Yeah. Could be. There might be because you, those kids out in the water. UAE can kind of relax a little bit and say, oh, uh, you know, this guy finished four minutes down on the time trial. He's not going to win the, the Giro d'Italia. <laughs> And you could let a breakaway go, you could let a breakaway go to the point where someone else snags it. Get this, get this clown off my... But <laughs> wow. Careful. Shit, dude. <laughs> we started laughing and then it spilled it. Wait, get the. It's nice with the ice t ice cubes too. I don't think I put ice cubes in them last time. No, I really didn't, because I have ice last time.
Cheers. Cheers. Birthday girl. Epic time. Epic roll. Yeah, last time it was so strong. And then I, like, I couldn't drink it. And I was like, eh, eh. <laughs> Whistle. Slave. Where'd Wait. you go? No, get me, get me, get me. Like. Ah! Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> see you, see you, I tell you, I love my back. I'm coming out of you. And if I lower you now, I think I would die. I knew you were. <laughs> yeah, if I get my, if I, I was get, my get my first pastry, get my first and only pastry that I ordered. Ooh. My first pastry. I haven't ordered anything else.